Find your voice. That's the theme for this year's summer reading program at the Kenton County Library. Gina Stegner is here with a look at some of the fun they've got planned for your family, and she brought some books in for us. Good to see you, Gina. You too. I love going to the library in the summer. So what should parents really know about how summer reading helps kids? Summer reading helps kids. Studies have shown that children who don't read through the summer do decline in their reading skills and it puts them behind when the new school year starts. So reading to your kids over the summer or ensuring that they are reading, whether you read together, they read by themselves, or even listening to a book is so important. And it's important for parents to read and set the example. And the libraries really make it fun in whatever neighborhood you're in. So you're gonna be having some kickoff parties. Tell me about the parties and some of the prizes that kids can stack up this summer when they read. Yes. So. On June 3rd will be our kickoff parties. Uh, uh, summer reading starts June 1st, but the parties will be on June 3rd okay. at each location. And you can check our website at kentonlibrary.org for the full details. But each one will be a party. It will um, carnival type atmosphere. Okay. So we'll games, have karaoke, yeah. we'll have games, music. Um, uh, I know that at some of the branches, we're gonna have a balloon artist. Oh, neat. It'll just be a really fun day. And you can pick up all the information about summer reading while you're there um, and learn how you can win really cool prizes. Yeah, like summer. what? What are some of the prizes? So for children, they can actually win this t-shirt. Oh, nice. Yes, <laughs> and adults can purchase this t-shirt while supplies last. There okay. are a limited number, um, but kids can win this. They also, as they continue to read, they can enter each week for gift cards and a grand prize nice. basket. And adults and teens can read all summer for a chance to win um, gift cards. Okay, that sounds pretty good. I mean, the books are free and you can win stuff. Uh, you've also got some games at some of the different places like scavenger hunts and chess clubs and things like that. But I also saw on your calendar that you're going out into the community for some events at parks. Tell me about that. Yes, yeah, so our outreach department, uh, along with some of our programming staff, will go out into the parks so that we come to where you are. Mm -hmm. You know, we know that sometimes it's just a gorgeous day and you want to be outside. <laughs> right. So let us come to you and we will have a program and, you know, kind of like a story time or maybe bring some games and just have a really good time out there. That sounds good. One of the things I always liked to do when my kids were little was go for the crafts. Because yes. the library always has good craft days. You doing that again this summer? Yes, we yeah. have a lot of crafts happening this summer. Um, painting and just different art stuff, stuff, making stuff in our stream center and maker space. Oh, good. So there's a lot of opportunities for adults, teens, and kids to do some really fun craft type programs. And you're also helping out with some lunches at the libraries, which is really good because a lot of kids rely on school for their lunch. Yes, we partner with local agencies to provide a free lunch at each branch. Um, you should check the website again yeah. to is see. Is it like one day a week? Yes, or, yeah. which day is at which branch. Okay. Um, and it's totally free for 18 and under. And at the Covington branch, it's free for adults too. Oh, that's nice. At the other two locations, it's just a nominal fee for the adults. Yeah, that's good. And we're talking about school age kids, but you have things even for babies and toddlers at the library too. Yes, um, we have story times and even little art programs for them and just exposing them to reading and getting them excited to want to come to the library and just getting them used to going to the library. I know for us, my almost two-year-old grandson, when I pull up to the library, he is just he's excited <laughs> and so excited because he knows yeah. that he's going to get to play with books and each branch has toys in it too so right. you know there's a little play area he gets to pick books it's yeah you know the older ones get to play on the computers it's, so get out yeah. and explore at your library this summer those kickoff parties again on june 3rd uh, but check with your local branch for all the other stuff going on all summer gina thank you always good to see you guys thank you have a good summer